Welcome everybody, this is your boy Gerardo Matoro and we are here with another video. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more content and we're going to get straight into the video. Welcome back everybody, before we do get straight into the video, I would like to give a big shout out and thank you to the supporters of this YouTube channel. A big shout out to Crazy Boss of V31, Wee's GNZ Gaming, Moldy Superman YT, and even Deity. Now these people are our YouTube members on our YouTube platform and I really do appreciate their support. So why don't you go inside my description below and go check them out and we're going to get straight into the video now this video is all about on how to install the Alice life mod inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder so like always make sure that you do download and install all of the latest requirements that's inside my description below once you have completed that process then download this mod and I will leave this mod inside my description below now this mod does require native UI, so make sure that you do download the latest version for native UI. Now this mod does require iFruit, but we will be getting it from the Enable All Interiors. So download Enable All Interiors, then we can get straight into it. Once you have finished downloading and installing all of your requirements, Go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click, and open the file location. Next, if you do not have a scripts folder, make sure that you do right click, and then create a new folder, and name that folder scripts. Make sure that you do spell scripts correct, and make sure it is all lowercase. Open up your scripts folder. Now, as you can see, I have already installed my native UI. DLL. So make sure that you do open up your native UI, extract folder, and now drag both files inside your scripts folder. Exit out of your extract folder. Next, open up your open all interiors, which is enable all interiors, extract folder. Now open up this folder, open up the scripts folder. So in here, all we need is the iFruit add-on 2. So click on the iFruit add-on 2 folder and add on to .dll. Drag both files inside your Grand Theft Auto V folder. Now you can install the Enable All Interiors if you want to, it's totally up to you. But it does require Lemon UI. So exit out of your extract folder. Now open up your ls life mod extract folder now all you got to do is select all the files and folder except for the text files and that's all yeah ah you guys now exit out of your extract folder now lastly go back to your grand theft auto v main folder right click refresh your game folder exit out of your game folder right click refresh your desktop and i'll see you guys in the game and now we are back and now we are in the game with Franklin. Now when you come into the game, you will see on your left hand side, two messages, okay? If you see two messages in green, that means the mod is working, okay? And if you see a bag on you, like Franklin, that means the mod is working. So all you got to do is go to your contacts, open up your phone, go to contacts, now go right down to the bottom and you'll see Z. Go and call Z and now you'll see a mod menu. Now what you can do, okay, these are some settings over here for you. And now you can order drugs if you want to, like weed. You can order how much weed you want, okay? Uh, depending on you. So yeah, and then go back and then now you can order crack, okay? Then now over here, place the order. Indeed, there you go. Now, okay, go and meet my people in Roxford Hill, okay? 
now, which is over here. So I'm going to go over there and we're going to go and meet the people. And now we're here, so basically they're around here somewhere. And here they are. You'll see them jumping out of the van, just wait for them. Now press E to deal with them. And now they'll bite off you. And then now press E again. And then now there you go. Then now you have picked up the drugs. So basically, it's uh, like a drug dealing mod for you. But um, yeah, it's pretty awesome. It's an awesome mod. Now what you can do is go back to your contacts. Go to Z again. And now you can ask for a lift or buy weapons. You can pay your debt, okay? Let's say ask for a lift. So you need someone to meet you. So someone's got to come to me. Uh, just got to wait for the... Gotta wait, gotta wait, gotta wait. Here he is. Someone's coming, so he's basically driving slow. And then now you can jump in the car with him. And now you can um, tell him where to go to take you. So this mod does work 100%, okay? And I hope you guys do enjoy the mod. And now we are back again on our PC, so like always, if you guys do get stuck installing this mod, then please let me know in the comments, and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that. Or if you do get stuck installing any other mods, then please let me know in the comments, and I'll be more than welcome to help you out on that. But unfortunately, I am not active on my YouTube comments, I am more active on my Discord server. So if you need fast reply, then head over to my description below and you'll see my Discord server link. Now make sure that you do join my Discord server and verify the PC modding support server. So with that said, if you guys did enjoy this video, then smash that like button and subscribe for more content and tutorials. And I will see you all on my next video. Thank you for watching. Peace. And I'm out.